Manuel Lombardo, second time taking a world silver medal. I know it's probably not the end you were hoping for, but how does it feel still to be standing on the world podium? Uh, it would be better if I I would lose uh, the the final uh, for uh, point for score or uh, maybe for the third shadow because it's difficult uh, to come back. Uh, uh, Knowing uh, that uh, I my mistake was to do a uh, stand swing and I touched the, the, the head for maybe less than one second. It would it it was difficult to uh, uh, relearn the so that suri without jumping, but uh, now I did just uh, a sensation uh, uh, technique. So it it will be hard to, to train and uh, develop this, uh, this thing. Uh, do you find any solace in the fact that this was the way that it ended and it wasn't in a, a big score or in a huge defeat that you are still capable of doing that or is it still a bit too fresh? Uh, when I did the, the score, I, I, I think that uh, I, I did uh, Vasari and uh, I, I was a world champion, so when uh, they they saw the car system, I was thinking uh, maybe no Vasari, I will continue. So it's uh, it's uh, it's hard now. I will think about uh, maybe for for some time. On a positive note, your last silver medal was actually in the under 66 kilogram category and now 73 and you've made a fantastic and quick adjustment really in terms of moving weight categories. So how do you feel in, in terms of your new weight uh, and how strong you feel going towards the Olympic Games next year? I can say genuinely that uh, it's the same when you change category. If you change category that uh, you you fool the, the weight category because uh, uh, when I was 66, I had uh, more kilo to lose and uh, I, I never was 100% uh, in competition. So now it's my category and maybe the, my opponents are uh, stronger, but uh, I'm uh, stronger too. So for me, it's the same, uh, the same feeling when uh, I fought in 66 and now in 70. Maybe better in 73 because I don't have to lose uh, many, many kilo. And uh, in general about your performance today, although the final didn't quite go the way you wanted, it was a very close head-to-head -head going at the golden score. Uh, one wasn't necessarily better than the other, but was there a moment today where you felt like this could be your day, like a fantastic con contest or throw or a new other experience? Uh, it was, uh, I think, uh, until the, the Sukumaki, it was uh, a good match because uh, uh, Nils uh, Stamp is a very strong uh, opponent, and uh, and uh, I I felt uh, a little bit better in the golden score that uh, I was improving, and uh, uh, I think uh, it would be maybe different if uh, we continued. Well, thank you very much and congratulations again for being a world finalist. Thank you. Thank you very much.